It's important to showcase the Army's history in this manner because by telling it through the uh, voices and the experiences of each soldier, uh, the average American gets a feel for what the service members, whether they are National Guard, Reserve, or active duty, uh, the experiences they had as a, as, a, as a service member. This project is so meaningful to the American soldier. This project is long overdue. Having a national museum to, to pay tribute to the sacrifices and the service of our American soldiers from really the start of this nation. This is America's Army Museum, showing America the history of our Army, the services and sacrifices, the story of our soldiers throughout all eras. The fact that we'll have the first ever National Museum of the United States Army is, is a significant event in and of itself. Places that are uh, particularly uh, interesting to me, of course, it would be the Medal of Honor the site within a building. It'll be the stories, how they're told by past service members and any other number of events which are in here, whether it's the battle streamers on the ceiling or the fighting vehicles within the main uh, area of the museum, I think it's going to tell a full, rich history of the American soldier. It's important to have Army leadership come to the site now while the museum's under construction, just to be able to understand the very purposeful design, the intent, the work that's gone into the exhibits and in being able to tell this very broad story. We're telling hundreds of years of history here in one museum, and we're doing that through the, through the eyes and the voices of, of soldiers from all eras. Hopefully it will inspire others to consider the Army as a career, but to appreciate it for all it's given back to society as well.